Hello possums, Dramus Smith here at our Mega Village makeover in the Dreaming Dominion. I'm quite happy with what we did last time. I want to get push on this time. Um, now, oh, sorry, wandering around in circles. Now, we built up some cooling towers, some houses on the dock. We've got this little area, which is when the fishermen bring their fish in, um, they can sell them directly from the boat or they can come here and make extra deals. Um, I'm thinking of having a little loading area here when we go to 114 and I've got barrels, they'll be here. But it's not really enough. What we need, what I want to do today, is put in a marketplace, a more general one. Fishermen can bring their produce up from the docks to here to sell, but also other people in the village can bring goods here to sell. Uh, Travelling merchants can. So we need a trading area here. I want to get some extra houses in and maybe think about um, putting some of the farmland back. So that's what we'll be doing. And... Um, Oh, I've got to work out a basic plan for a market stall and I might flatten some of this out a bit. So um, that's probably where we'll start. I need a shovel. Oh, and we're going to need to go sleep. I always seem to be starting these just as the sun's going down, don't I? Uh, we'll put it here, so we'll start with clearing back some of this. Um, oh, that's a bit concerning. There's lava right under here. Better be careful clearing sand. Last thing I want is to be dropped into a pool of lava. All right, we've got a bit of an area cleared. We've got steps up. I'm thinking we might put a little fountain here and then arrange the market around it. So... There we go, we've got a platform for it. Uh, we can. Do we want our fountain large or small? Probably small. Yep, I think that's okay. I might pave the whole thing with sandstone when I'm done, I'll see. Uh, we need a bucket. And we need something to waterlog. Right, I've got some iron bars. Um, I've got a bucket. There we go. Oh, that's quite nice. I need some light in it. I'll have to get some sea lanterns or something for that. But, yeah, that'll do us for our fountain. I 
And oh look, it's night again. Oh, and there's something I really, really want to do. I really, really want to get rid of this. There has to be a better solution. That's not it. So I've got to think about how I want this to work. The little stalls that just cluster around this and then we'll have houses up here and up here and over there. So Let's start. Um, now they won't be made of sandstone, they'll be made of wood. So I know that much. Because the idea is that they're temporary structures, so oh, probably five wide. And they'll be largely open. So. I'm not sure if I'm doing this right. And maybe I want them out of acacia, I don't know. Uh, I want some stairs. Why is that only four wide? Because it is only four wide. Okay, maybe this one's little. What do we think of that? Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, I like that. Question is, what is the center? Do we go with something like that? And don't tell me it doesn't match up because I know it doesn't. Do we put carpet on the top which will mean I need string or something. Hmm, I'm going to have to think about what we want to do. Right. All right, let's get up there. A lot of mucking around, isn't there? Sorry about this. Now, what do we think? too bad. I think we might hang some banners off it in the morning. Alright, so we've got those. They're not bad. And I think we'll hang one here and one there. 
that's not bad. And we can put some chests and some barrels and things in. Some fish. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's okay. I'll make a few more of those. And that's our little market. I think that's really big enough for this area. I don't think we need much more than that. We've got four stalls. We've got three little stall areas marked out with carpets. Um, we'll put produce in here at some point, but I think that's our market done. I don't think that's bad at all. Um, next we probably need uh, some houses in. So that'll just be the normal thing. I'll have to move these I think. And oh, we might put some of the farmland back. Yeah. I think that's a good way to go. And a big apology to everyone because there's about a week between making this market and now. Yeah, I'll, I'll take that down. Um, the morning after I did this, I got up and while I had a voice, it wasn't one anyone would have wanted to listen to. I had a really bad throat infection. I sounded dreadful. I also felt dreadful. I had no wherewithal to build anything. I just couldn't think, couldn't decide. Oh, I spent two days just lying in bed. <laughs> I kept thinking, I'll come and finish this, I'll come and finish this. And it didn't happen. So I am really, really sorry. But let's get finished today. So let's get building. Let's get some houses in. Let's get this village back underway. And I think the best way to do that is with a time lapse.
think that might be it for today. I know I've only done three houses and two towers, but uh, I do actually want to get this out. It's so late already and I'm really sorry. So we'll have a quick look around. Um, we've got our two little joined green houses, one lime, one green. And I'm still not sure if I like that. I'll sort it out. But this one, I will give it some steps up from the street and it'll have a little garden here possibly with a little wall around it. And then we've got a cooling tower and you know if the wind comes in this way it hits those back walls and comes down. We've got another tower up there that was the ruined building that just generated with this village. And then we've got, oh, I really like this pink terracotta comes out this really lovely mulberry pink colour. I really like it. But um, odd little house, I think it's okay, but quite nerve wracking to build it because it's obviously over lava and I kept thinking the ground's going to collapse any second. It didn't, but I did worry about it. I might just pop these in to finish it off. And we'll do the same here and at the front. Yeah. Yeah, that's better. Okay. I might put an awning over that. I might leave it. I don't know. But we've got our market. We've got some extra little houses in. I'll put some veggie gardens back in. And when we come back next time, we'll be doing the wall and just finishing up with some detailing and getting this village done. So it's looking a bit more like a village now. I'm quite happy with that. Hopefully you are too and I'm really sorry this is a week late but hopefully you've liked it and if you have you know what to do. Whack the like button, subscribe if you haven't and remember to hit that notification bell and select all so that you get all the notifications from me about my videos. And on that note, I'll say, till next time, bye!